Although life in water puts many severe constraints on the design of fish, it has similar body shape like that of a boat. The middle portion tapers at the ends and forms a specific shape of the body called as streamlined body. Thus, the streamlined body offers less resistance against the current of water and facilitates swimming, the essential mode of locomotion. Each fish has a set of vertebrae and segmented muscles that continue from head to tail. This group of bones and muscles help the fish to propel itself from side to side as it swims through the water. During swimming, the muscles of the fish body are highly active. The muscles of the front part of the body make it to curve on one side and simultaneously the tail part of the body swings to the opposite side. Now this similar position is just reversed and the fish swims a little ahead. The front and the tail part of the body curve to the opposite side. While changing or reversing the position, the body faces a jerk and this pushes the body forward. A series of jerks make the fish to swim ahead. This forms curves in the fish body. But without fins and tail, this movement is not possible. A fin is a membrane supported by rays or spines that function in swimming or orientation in the water. The movement in fish is supported by fins and tails on the fish body. These fins play three important roles for a fish. They help in swimming, giving directions as well as keeping the balance of the body. The fusiform type of streamlined body of the fish along with the fins and tail facilitate the complex way of locomotion. Hence, inspired by this mechanism, underwater divers wear fin-like flippers on their feet to help them move easily in water.